Oh, welcome back. In the last episode, in case you missed it, we got a new power. Well, it wasn't that one. It was this one. We can slow down time. We also did uh, finish the casino area, which was, well, I mean, they're all casinos, but specifically the one that we started two episodes ago, but we couldn't find a way to finish. We also did have a showdown with Foxy, and of course, we destroyed her by running away courageously, as only men should do. And uh, yeah, let's just jump right into it. We only need one more key to unlock the other area. Actually, we need two more keys. And we have two more missions. I'm trying to see what the Muksh, oh, that's just Muksh's turf. Yeah, we have the race and we have the back alley heist. So we're going to do the back alley, back alley heist first. Which I believe... Yeah, it's that one over there. Don't die, please. Wait, is this the one? No, I think that did this one the last mission. Yep. So where the hell is the back alley ice? Do do do. Possibly that one. Dude, violence is only acceptable if you can actually win. Otherwise, quiet down. Wait, this was this where I was just at. I can't believe I just took another freaking way around. did this one already as well. Okay, what? And of course I died. <laughs> I mean, I guess this has to be the one, but I feel like I did all the missions already. There we go. We got there in the end. See if we can unlock a new power as well. The slowdown one was uh, kind of disappointing. The best one is still dive. She's so damn useful. Other powers don't compare at all. Look at that. Like... What have what what roll or slowdown do in that situation? Nothing. Except get me killed. Okay. Thank you. Dude, jump. Can't get the freaking model now. Honestly, that's good. It resets the air conditioner in that little area so I can get the freaking uh, clue. And that's the lie I'm telling myself. Okay. <laughs> I'm down to my last life again.
That freaky... That, I think that was the first time Mr. Mace Man killed me. Piss off. Thank you very much. Ah, damn, I missed. Hmm. I feel like I could climb this, but I guess not. This isn't even bring me anywhere. Hmm. I want that freaking bottle, man. See me? It cannot. I am Sly Cooper, master of disguise. Despite the fact that I'm wearing no disguise. One time. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, balls. for pissing off. Wow. How? Come on. There we go. One more. There we go. over here. Nothing. Alright. The emptiness of the void. I have a feeling I'm, it's gonna, I'm gonna be one bottle short and I'm gonna be Pissed. Wait. So that's where the key is. All right.
And now we have the most difficult challenge in my entire gaming career. A freaking race. Hey, maybe we'll be lucky we won't need it. Apparently the game is really good at math. Is that race? Go away. This is the one? Yeah, it is. The bane of my existence. Hurry, what's going on down there? Well, I drove to this hot dog stand for a quick snack, and the next thing you know, I'm getting challenged to a race by these gangster dogs. Is there a key in it for the winner? Yeah, three times around the track for a key. It's all you, man. Drive the van with the left analog stick. And if you manage to pick up any natural power-ups, you can get a boost by pressing the square button. Go get him. I'm on it. All right, let's do this. Come on. I have all the confidence in myself. Despite the fact that everybody gets a boost. Oh, my God. Not, not a terrific start. baby. Despite the fact that I'm being weighed down by a 2,000 pound gorilla, I mean hippo. Come on. You cheeky bastard, I needed that. Oh, man. Come on. Okay. In the last episode, well, the second to last episode, I lost this challenge like five freaking times. And now I get it on the first try. RNG is a son of a bitch. <laughs> ah, this is hilarious. Good job, Murray. You, you did really well. Let's see if we can take on Mugshot in this episode. What? Bastard. Now if we do have the boss fight, we're going to go into it without any freaking uh, horseshoes.
<laughs> okay, that's awesome. His tongue becomes the the doorway. It's awesome. To your left. Well, actually, I was right in front of you, but last call. Oh, I mean, yeah, this is the boss fight. have been yapping about some big mysterious dude running around cracking skulls and <laughs> and and this is it you're the monkey wrench in my operation some scrawny rat with a stick right. i'm a raccoon another rat i seen that stick before maybe when my father knocked your block off with it your father <laughs> wow you're a cooper you know that thing is Rakamagookas had a lot of nice pictures, but way too many big boys. So you don't mind just handing it over? Why? <laughs> what are you kidding? You break into my place, steal my stuff, trash the joints. I feel transgressed and violated. Let's rock. Oh, the dude has a thesaurus under his freaking. Are those two machine guns on his back? Oh boy, this is gonna not be that fun, is it? I have a cane, this dude has two assault rifles. Can I hit you? That hit the mirrors. Oh, the mirrors. Got it. Gotcha. Yes, try again. It's alright. I'm just getting used to the fight. Of course you do. Because who doesn't have a spare gun? Oh, I got caught behind the mirror. See where the hell all the mirrors are. Oh, wait, I didn't even realize I had a horseshoe. Because the game felt sorry for me. No funny line this time? Oh, what the hell? Hmm, felt that one coming. Well, that one coming. I got a spare upstairs. 
Come on, Bulldog. Let's finish this. Does he flip it around when he shoots it again? Yes, he does. That's what I figured. Ah, uh, mm, That was stupid of me. Come on, man. I was in the freaking air. Damn, the dude really skipped leg day. Look at his tiny underbelly. Undercarriage. Wait, what? Okay. Ah, oh, missing one. There we go. Why? Why was that so easy? A little pipsqueak like you beating a big strong bruiser like me. I'm smarter than you. That's why. I also have infinite lives. You want all of that stupid picture book? You're gonna have to go down to hate me and cross paths with Miss Wu. And then believe you me, you don't wanna be you. The mugshot section of the Thievius Raccoonus contained an entry from my gunslinging ancestor, Tennessee Kid Cooper. Please tell me I'm getting a gun. The was the rail walk and rail slide. Moves perfected through a lifetime of theft in the Old West. Getting out of town proved to be a little more challenging than getting in. Having just missed us, Inspector Fox went for the next best thing and dragged that canine steroid case off to jail. <laughs> that was the end of Mugshot's gambling empire, and Mesa City's citizens soon returned home. While me and the boys, well, we enjoyed the rest of our stay in America, and then returned to Paris, ready for our next mission. Okay, with that last fight, it it was actually pretty straightforward. The whole thing is, I kept doing double jumps on the last stage. That one was messing me up. So, you know, I actually have to say, that dude was easier than the frogger. The bulldog was much easier than the frog, dude. 
But either way, we are going to end it here. As always, if you do enjoy the episodes, do consider hitting like and subscribe. Great way to support the channel. And I will see you next time.